Okay, what's up, YouTube? Uh, I've got to make this video quick. They only give me 10 minutes. Uh, two minutes was wasted on an intro. Okay, video cards. This is what I started off with. This is a NVIDIA uh, gaming card. This is this is not what you want. Most of them, and I say most because I think all of them, have uh, uh, a, a DVI and a VGA. This is analog. This is uh, digital. You want something that that's going to give you digital, you know? Digital is, is, is the new wave. I mean, you don't want to run six monitors and have three of these, and three of them have to be digital and three have to be analog. I mean, you know, you can do that if you want, but, you know, this is, this is just a kitty card, okay? This is, this is, I'm in high school and I like to play video games. You know, this is not what you want. This is not what you need. These two right here, these are NVIDIA cards also, but these are pro cards. These are big boy cards right here. This is money-making cards. Um, you can see this right here. This one runs two monitors, and this connects into here. It's, it's a dongle, okay? And this one can run VGA and um, um, digital, okay? Uh, I have six digital monitors and two VGA. Uh, you just pop this off. Bam, and, and it's digital. This is the the, the VGA uh, connector, you know. To uh, anyway, for lack of a better word, connector. Um, so anyway, this right here is the NVS uh, four. No, the NVS two ninety. Uh, it's a Nvidia Quadro NVS two ninety, and it runs two monitors. It's heat sink cooled, and it has two fifty six megabytes of onboard uh, RAM. That's good. Both of these cards have their own memory. That means it's not sucking juice out of your uh, out of your on out of your computer's memory, which is a good thing. They have their own mojo. You know what I'm saying? This right here is the this one right here is a bad boy. Uh, this is the Nvidia Quadro NVS 420. Uh, it's a nice card. Uh, make sure that when you get when you get one of these they have two different models. They're actually, they're the same video card, but two different, um, two different uh, dongles that that connect to it. And uh, if you look on eBay, uh, that's the cheapest place to get it. And they have the model numbers on most of them. And the one you're looking for is the one that ends in X sixteen dash D V I dash P B, as in Playboy. Uh, Let's see, um, and this one right here has a dongle similar to this, except it's got four. You're never going to get VGA to run off of this, so so if, you, if you're thinking you're going to get this and, and, and get a, a VGA monitor run off of it, it you're, it's never going to happen. Uh, this one's cool. It's got 512 megabytes of onboard memory uh, with a heat sink for cooling, plus it has its, its own fan. This one's nice. Uh, 500 bucks for this on Tiger Direct. They're pretty cheap, Tiger Direct. They have good deals, uh, but on eBay got this inbox. Just saw one for three hundred dollars inbox, brand new with ninety day warranty. This one retails for about a hundred and fifty, um, and you get you can get that on uh, eBay for under fifty. I got it for forty eight dollars. Okay, one more thing about these. These are both. Oh, before I get to that, this card. These these are all Nvidia cards. Okay. But this card right here is never going to work with these two. It will never work with these two. Why? Because this card, this gaming card, uses different drivers than, than these. Also, these are 2D cards. This is 3D. This is a 3D card. You don't need this for trading. You don't need 3D. You need 2D. These are built for professional rigs, okay? Um, can, can you play games on this? Sure, you can. You can play games. Can you watch movies? Of course, you can watch movies. Uh, but uh, um, 2D, that's what these are. These are pro cards. Uh, also, okay, so moving on here. These are both PCI Express cards. These will work together. They use the same drivers. Are they the same card? Absolutely not. Will they work together? Absolutely. Uh, you can see here, this is a PCI Express, and this is PCI Express. But look, this is a PCI Express X16 slot. This is an X1 slot, okay? Uh, they, they fit into the slot on, on the computer, and you can see here 
the orange, see this right here? This is the same as this one right here. I have two of these. That's an X1 slot, that orange slot it's fit, fitting into. And uh, this is an X16 slot for this one, for this. Okay? Now here's the moral of the story. You can get this to fit into this X4 slot. It'll fit into that. Uh, smaller will fit into bigger, but bigger will never fit into smaller. This X16, you're never going to get into this X4 or X1 slot. Uh, that's just the way they were de were designed. It's common sense, but, uh, you know, uh, so so just because you don't have a bunch of X1 slots, don't worry about that. You can get this to fit into an X2, an X4, like here, an X8, and an X16, but I could never get it to work on the X16. It was just too loose. Okay, so that was uh, just a quick thing on uh, video cards. Uh, we'll talk more about uh, the inside on, on a...